What up? All right. What up? No, seriously. What's up? Tell me. Say it really loud so it embarrasses people around you. What up, every day? I don't know why I said it like that. Okay, let's get started. So I had a kid on YouTube ask me a question. It was on um, doing slow. Okay. So I'm gonna read the question and I'm gonna work the problem. It says the problem is a line with a slope of negative one, which slope is m equals negative one. All right. And it says it passes through the points at two, three, and five. Y, which that's an awful usage because you think of oh, Y and it's going to get confusing when you slope intercept formula, etc. Find the value of Y. Alright, well, let's work this problem. Okay, May, the month, let's work the problem. Okay, so we got this. Now, there's a couple different ways to work it. If you wanted, there's a couple steps you could use in the slope intercept formula, which is Y equals MX plus B. I don't think that's necessary. I think we can just use the slope formula. Okay, so if this is a slope. The slope formula is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1, correct? Okay, so what I always recommend to my students and everybody else, label this stuff. It's an x, this is a y, x, and it's a y, this is x1, because it's problem 1, x2, y2. And I'm just going to separate those two because it's confusing because there's a y there. Whatever. Okay, so we plug our stuff in and we solve it, okay? We already know what it equals. We know our slope equals negative 1, okay? Cool. So now we just do the little thing I always say, which is plug in what you know to find what you don't know. Okay, here we go. So let's plug in our stuff. Y2 is our Y minus our Y1 is 3 over X2, which is 5 minus sign X1 is 2. So we simplify it. I can simplify this. It'll be Y minus 3. 5 minus 2 is 3. Now we got to get rid of the stuff furthest away from Y, which isn't the thing hanging out on the same floor as it. It's going to be that 3. So how do you get rid of divide by 3? Multiply by 3. So multiply both sides by 3. That cancels out. We got y minus 3 equals negative 1 times 3 is negative 3. What do I do to get rid of that 3? Add it. Negative 3 plus 3 is 0. And you got your answer. That's how you do it. Now, do you want to check it? Sure, you can check it. Plug your stuff in, okay, and redo the problem. Um, make sure we did it right. Let's see. We want the slope to be negative 1. Let's plug our stuff in. It's y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Plug our stuff in. So that'd be, we said our y is 0. So it'd be 0 minus 3 over 5 minus 2. That'd be negative 3 over 5 minus 2 is 3, which simplifies negative 1. That's what we want. That's what we got. That's the finish of the What up? Thank you for watching the video. I for real, for real appreciate that. You know I do. You know I do, girl. Um, or dude, whatever. Okay, so, if you could, real quick, I'm going to run through. Check me out on Facebook. If you want, just type in Tyler Tarver. It'll pop up Tyler Tarver is okay. Or you can just go facebook.com slash Tyler's okay. Or you can just do fb.com slash Tyler's okay. Yeah, Facebook jumped on that. Got the fb.com. Good job, Facebook. Check me out on Twitter, Tyler Tarver. Twitter.com slash Tyler Tarver. T Y L E R T A R V E R. Blah. Check me out on Instagram. Just search Tyler Tarver. Once again, blah. I got our Tyler Tarver and everything except for Facebook. It's Tyler's okay. Did my best. Sorry, Mom. Okay. If you want, um, you can check out my website. It's TylerTarver.com. Or if you're on YouTube, you just click this. It'll take you to my regular YouTube page where I post videos that are less math and more not math. I try to be funny. <laughs> I'm just kidding. And then you go to TarverAcademy.com. It's got a lot of math videos. Try to organize them for you. Got tons of math videos. Little help videos. Some that are just off there. Some where I'm up here. <laughs> Look at me, everybody. All right. And then you can also click that if you're on YouTube. And it'll take you to my math channel, which is YouTube.com slash Sir Tyler Tarver. So if you're interested in math videos, got a ton of math videos on there. And I'm putting more on there all the time. So in conclusion, you just go ahead and go to the Facebook page. You know, be a, you know, click a like or whatever. Check out the Twitter, follow, and then you go to Instagram, you're like, ah, oh, and then you're going to go over here, and you're going to subscribe to this YouTube channel, which is just search Tyler Tarver. It's the only ones that don't have math videos, and then you search Tyler Tarver, pops up this one, so. Just going to wait. I'll just wait right here. Just wait right here for you to go do all those things. Just click it, and it'll probably pop it in the window. Just go ahead and search. And get your phone out, whatever, you just, just wait. I'm, 
I really am going to wait until you go do all of the things that I asked you to do. That's all I'm asking! Just go do all the stuff that I asked! <laughs>